Hello and welcome to an ORCAD tutorial on how to import the general piece by libraries and importing real components. So first you want to open up CIS Capture, Capture CIS, and it'll prompt the start page. Once you have this open, you want to hit new project, name your new project, select the first option. Select where you want to save it and hit OK. It'll create these files for you here. What you want to do is select on the DSN, open up schematic, and page. Then go ahead and press place on top, part. You'll get this window prompted. Here, is typically empty if you're just starting ORCAD. So what you want to do is hit add library and it'll take you to a folder. If not, I can show you where it lives, cadence, and all the way down you want to get to library. What you want to do is add all of these OLD file types here. So it'll be very useful for you in the next coming tutorials so you want to you can drag your mouse to select all of them or a faster way is select the first one scroll all the way down hold shift and press the last one and it will select everything in between and hit open now i suggest you download all the ones here all the ones you can find here especially download the one in the pspice folder these guys as well as these guys and the model ones which are individually in each folder so again you want to hit the folder hit the first one go all the way down and hold shift and click on the last one, we'll select all of them, hit open, and it would have added all of those libraries to your ORCAD library. Next, I'm going to show you how to download real components. So for the project, we are importing two real components, the gate driver UCC21520 and the silicon carbide MOSFET SCT3160KL. So you want to just go ahead and Google it, the SPICE model, hit the first link, go to design tools and simulation, you want the PSPICE model, and hit download. Next, same thing, go ahead and just Google the, the model name and type spice model. Click the first link, hit tools. Go ahead and click spice model, agree, and download. They'll be downloaded as zip files. So what you want to do is just unzip them. And typically I just save it in my downloads here. Here is the silicon carbide MOSFET files. What we want is the OLB file here. And for the gate driver, again, we want the OLB file. So remember where you saved it. Going back to ORCAD, we're going into File, Import, PSPICE. We want to browse for where we saved the OLB file. Now, what's annoying about ORCAD is they don't tell you that you need the OLB file. You kind of have to search for it. So you want to make sure you're in the All Files File Type and go ahead and click on the folder and we want 
the Oh, well, I'm gonna go ahead and click open and hit OK. So if we type in UCC two one, an easy way to find the components you just imported, you want to go ahead and Go into your library, control A, control all, it'll select all the libraries and you just need to type the part UCC21520. And I was able to find it for me. Typically you want to select not from the design cache. Go ahead and double tap and you can just place a component there. Again, and the easiest way to find a component is to just click on the library, control A to find it. Let's find our silicon carbide SCT and it just auto completed for me. Again, let's try not to use the design cache. Double click, and there you go. You have real components imported. Lastly, if you want to simulate this design, you need to make sure to add it to the library. So to do that, go and open up this folder here. And you want to go and right click on library, add file. Same process here. What you need to do is you've added the component to your ORCAD, but you needed to add it to your project. So again, find where the OLB file lives and open it. You'll see that it gets added here. You want to add it to the project. And again, the same step, OLB file. And we've just added our two real components onto our library for the project, as well as your ORCAD software. And that's the end of this tutorial. We will be using this to create our two topologies. Thank you.